I'm about to cut the wolf off soon. I'm about to go to the shop and cut the wolf off soon. So I just figured that, you know, I make a video for y'all to show y'all how, how I've been managing, you know, my little quick lay down my wolf routine to show y'all how I've been taming this wolf, yo. I know a lot of y'all are still just maybe not that confident or comfortable with wolfing or still struggle with taming a wolf. So I just figured I get straight into it. You already know, man, like we always in the building. Before I go ahead and show y'all what I'm looking like, the keys to taming your wolf, having a successful wolf, when you're growing your hair out and just trying to manage it, you really need to be washing. So you need to have a wash schedule. If you're a beginner, I always say like at least two times a week. Some people may do more than that, whatever makes you feel comfortable, but at least two times a week. Stay on top of your washes and comb. I'm not gonna say brush or you need to be brushing because y'all already know you need to be brushing. If you're watching this video right now, you need to be brushing. So we know you need to be brushing. But when it comes to wolfing, you need to be combing and make sure you're washing. And when I mention that, you know you need to be brushing. You need to be brushing with all three brushes but definitely that hard brush. There is no way you are going to have a successful wolf if you are really wolfing, especially heavily wolfing, if you are not brushing with a hard brush. You are supposed to be using all three brushes. So don't think you're gonna be wolfing and just using a medium brush all the way through. That's not gonna do it. You're not really taming it. You gotta really tame it. The whole point of wolfing is to keep your waves laid down as much as possible while we're you know gonna go in for comb sessions and brush sessions and still putting products and stuff in our hair we want to keep it as laid as possible you're not going to be able to do that if you're just brushing with a medium brush because you're not combing out them forks you're not stretching out them waves you're not doing none of that so understand need the hard brush along with your other two brushes your medium and soft so You see that? Y'all see how laid that looks, yo. Y'all see how laid that looks, man. Got a bit of over curling going on. I know a lot of y'all panic and start getting worried about over curling, but the truth is over curling is really not that deep. But I will have, you know, a video in the future for y'all when it comes to over curling to show y'all what you do and how you can handle that. It's really not that deep. For the most part, if you feel like you know, you're know you over curling a little too much, it's just time to go get the chop and get back to it. Just go ahead and subscribe if that's something you're looking forward to in the future. And just let me know down below in the comments. So yeah, as for my routine, yo, this, this, whole, this whole just managing the wolf, this is something you could just add to your morning method or your night method. Anytime you want, just go ahead and Feel like you want to get a session in or whatever the case may be when you're wolfing this into something you should always be doing and this will really help to just manage that wolf prior to this video i did do an mob if y'all ain't hip to what mob is mob is moisturized oil and butter i did my little method go ahead and subscribe and like the video if that's something else you're looking forward to if y'all want me to drop my mob method and what that looks like and how i handle that i would definitely do that for y'all for this quick wolf routine all you need is a comb your hard medium soft your glove or your plastic bag and a do-rag i'm gonna just start off by just getting a comb session in Medium. 
like to go on with a toothbrush. If you got a toothbrush or a crown brush, this also, also helps with closing your crown. So you can check that out. It should pop up on the screen somewhere if you need help with closing your crown. Then you just go on with the glove. If you don't gotta lay down, G, you know the the, the lay down glove. You can always just use a plastic bag, but if you can. You just want to rag back up. This is just a routine that, as I said, you can incorporate it with your night method, your morning method, even you know when you want to add products. If your hair's a little dry or whatever the case may be, just always make sure your hair is washed before you add products. And then you just this is what you really want to do. And when you add the repetition of like doing the routine we just went through, you'll be able to manage your waves and have your 360 waves as late as possible. You can double compress it as well. If double compress it makes you feel more confident or comfortable with laying your waves down. Once you kind of learn how you can manage your 360 waves during the wolf, you pretty much there. If you got any value out of this video, always be sure to like, share, and subscribe. I'm Beantown Spins. And over here, we always waving.